Thank you. When it comes to the issue of companies paying their fair share of tax or corporation tax, we have made some progress at European level with the Administrative Cooperation Directive and the Anti-Tax Avoidance Directive. Personally, I have supported country-by-country country reporting since I came to this Parliament 12 years ago. We also have BEPS, and today we have the latest proposals on CCCTB. Indeed, there are positive aspects to this proposal, and it will help to further tackle tax evasion. But there is a price. Yes, tax rates will be untouched, but tax sovereignty will be eroded. Member States will no longer be able to decide what is deductible, what is non-deductible, for example. Ministers for Finance will not be able to change certain tax provisions during budgets, even if they believe it will benefit their economy. So this proposal asks Member States to hand over significant new powers to the Commission. The other issue that concerns me is where corporation tax will be paid. Has any analysis been done to see what countries will lose corporation tax revenue and what countries will gain corporation tax revenue under your apportionment model? This model means that member states with small domestic markets like my own, Ireland or the Netherlands, who have secured significant foreign direct investment, will lose out on corporation tax revenue. It's absolutely essential that figures are produced so that member states know the extent of the changes. This proposal has merit, but there will be winners and losers. And if you want agreement, Commissioner, I believe this issue has to be dealt with head on.